Dear friends, welcome to Sant'Agata Bolognese, welcome to Lamborghini. Before I start, on behalf of the entire Lamborghini family, I would like to express my sincere sadness and concern for all those affected by the situation in Ukraine. Our thoughts are with the Ukrainian people, both those in the country and the hundreds of thousands who have been displaced by the conflict. Lamborghini considered sport as a good platform to, to share strong messages and to promote fair competition. Today we are here to introduce our new Huracan-based race car. Since 1963, all Lamborghini cars have been made here, including here at the Huracan production line, the track-oriented Huracan STO and its brand new racing version, the Huracan GT3 Evo 2. Since 2015, we have produced and sold more than 450 units and also thanks to the new GT3 EVO 2, we will reach the 500 mark within the summer of 2022. The racing Huracans have a distinct history in motorsport and the success story of the last years have given global visibility to the brand and have contributed to an increased fan base and brand awareness. Racing is fueled by passion, but motorsport and endurance races are also the best proving ground for our super sports cars. We look forward to everything that is to come with the new Huracan GT3 Evo 2. And now, let's have a look at the car. The new Huracan GT3 Evo 2 is not just an evolution. It's a brand new car, homologated uh, thanks to the Huracan STO and will be eligible to race in the next few seasons. It's based on the experience achieved uh, uh, in the last racing seasons with more than 70 championships uh, uh, won and it's taking care about the new uh, technical feature and safety requirement of the FIA. With a new aero package, uh, with new technical feature on the engine, uh, the car will be ready to race starting from January 2023. Of course, there will be the opportunity to upgrade uh, the previous generation of Huracan GT3 chassis. Daytona 23 will be the first race. See you soon on the track. Developing a new racing car is always challenging, especially when the car is already a great product. But again, the Squadra Corsa engineers, they deliver the job. As you can see, the hexagonal air scoop and the rear fin are derived directly from the Huracan STO, which gives a much better air intake efficiency and better car balance. The scoop is connected to a snorkel, which goes directly into the engine air intake system. This replaces the old side air intake. This also gives a much better throttle responsiveness and suits every kind of driving style demand. The new carbon fiber floor together with the new rear diffuser give much more aero efficiency compared to the current GT3 car. And it remains easy to drive. The new braking system together with the new ABS and the new dedicated traction control actually makes the car so much easier to drive even in lower grip conditions. This is a perfect machine for both endurance and sprint races. High performance and easy to drive, it's perfect either if you are a pro or an amateur driver. Yeah. 